Hello everyone, welcome back to City Skylines. So I still haven't figured out the whole issue with Spore. So I'm just going to continue with these other series until I can get Spore to work. So for now, we've got... Let's see, we're going back to our industrial area here. I was actually able to get the little last bottom part down here to work. We got 293 people already in our town, which is nice. Little town of Lakedale here. Let's see here. Go back. Let's see, they're definitely demanding residential, so. I'm trying to avoid death waves as much as possible. So I'm not going to do that much on the residential. Maybe two blocks. There we go. Kind of keep that going. Make sure we got power and electricity to everything. Hang on, I gotta take care of that here. Cover streams fine. We have enough electricity as we go. Okay. Hmm. So let's see. Looks like there's still a decent demand for residential. So we'll go back over. And we'll add some more residential. Get our suburbs to grow a little bit more. Kind of grow it this way before we go it that way, since our commercial is going to be down this direction. I'm going to wait on the commercial because it looks like there's still room for growth there. Change color scheme. So pardon that little interruption. Wants me to optimize performance. So we're optimizing. It actually helps a little bit. Not much. Okay, let's see here. Oh good, our uh, demand for residential is going down. Which means the other demand should be coming up here soon. We should be reaching our 500 person milestone relatively quickly here. We'll kind of let it run its course, and while it does, I just want to mention, you, you know, not many people are going into the comments right now. I realize I don't have too many subscribers or anybody watching the videos too consistently right now, but... I am willing to take suggestions and hear what you have to say. So let me know what you want to see in games like this, whether it be, you know, a certain design in the roads, or if it's more like what, what you want to see on the creature, or in Minecraft, what you want me to build, and stuff like that. I'm considering building, like, the logo of the losing team for the Super Bowl later today, and then burning it. Um, so, you know, go Broncos. I'm not a Broncos fan, but I'd like to see the Broncos win. Um, and it would be, it would be fun. Who knows? I don't know. I'm just recording an episode of City Skylines right now. So, let's see. Demand for industrials going up. Okay. Okay. So, let's put in... Hey, little Hamlet, reach a population of 460. We have a medical clinic, elementary school, and land sites. So let's go ahead and open this. And we got a landfill now. I'm gonna put the landfill right. Now I'm. I'm gonna see. Are we able to dirt road? We are. Lovely. I'm gonna make a little dirt road. 
off the side of the bridge here. I gotta do it downstream, that's right. Downstream from the water supply. Space already occupied. There we go. And there we go. Okay. Now let's get that dump. away from everything. Alright, and let's get a medical clinic. One on each side of the bridge. I want to keep medical clinic kind of centralized here. Everyone's a yay. Two shots. Toads are hypnotic abilities. Oh, all hail the hypnotoad. All hail the hypnotoad! Okay. I'm having too much fun with that. And put you in there. Excellent. Get yourself as an adjumation. Let's see. I need to get some health care on the other side of the river. I don't. I don't. I don't. Don't. That makes things convenient. Makes things and then garbage will be taken care of by that. Care of by that. Sweet. Sweet. Okay, this is nice. This is nice. So it's demanding more residential now. More residential now. Which I will be happy to appease. Happy to appease. All right, the suburbs are really starting to fill in. Really nice. I just wish we had parts right now. How much longer until? How much longer until I have the next milestone? We need 9:50. That's easy enough to to obtain. I'm gonna leave that blank. I'm gonna try my best to leave these middle ones blank so that everything's sort of centralized. Or when we get like fire, please. And stuff like that. Let me let that grow out a little bit. Let's see. I could put more commercial down here, but it's not really going to do all that much good. I'm surprised we don't have a ton of demand for commercial right now. I'm sure that time will come when we get a whole bunch of commercial and stuff like that, but for now, it's just going to be what it is. Sad it. Sad it. Let's see. Um, um I'm gonna go ahead and add, add a little, little bit more. Add a little bit more. Residential since it seems residential to have been a lot of people are moving in, a lot of people in the suburbs are gonna die all at once, but I don't care. I don't care. Um, um yeah. You already got a road across town. I wish I had highways, honestly. Maybe you do. Maybe I'm just lucky. Nope. How, how, how much do I have to wait until we get highway? Wait until we get 5,500? Oh, that's with Sunbury. What about with that? So. Okay. Off I come and back on I go. How much? 2,600. Okay, that's going to be... And then ramps, I think, will come with it. Yeah. That's not too shabby. I can't wait until we unlock all these roads and just do a, a whole bunch of upgrades. Everything seems to be running very smoothly, which is very concerning to me. I guess we'll uh, add some more residential. That should be plenty of residential. Yeah, that should be plenty of residential. I could do right there, but that could much. This is like the housing crisis type thing. We build too many houses, value goes down, people get scared, yada yada yada. It's the start of town, people. Sorry to get political. 
Um. Why isn't there demand for anything else? You know what? I'm gonna fill out the rest of the small industrial area, and hopefully that will bring jobs and people and all that stuff. Hopefully it doesn't build too fast. And for now, I'm gonna leave that there. I might have to make that industrial later, rezone it, make all of this. Make like a block off here, or a commercial, and then do like parks or something over here. And when I get to that, the parks finally unlock, which I think is at a thousand, fifteen hundred. Okay. Okay. Let's see here. But I'm gonna deal with and put some there. Man, growth is slow. More residential, since they still demand residential for some unknown reason. I'm halfway tempted to upgrade this to four on the outside. That's like unnecessary. Hopefully this will come. Oh. Oh, we've got a tiny bit of demand for... For this kind of... It's fully spaced on name. Industrial! Yay! Okay. Okay, good. The demand is really going down for... Residential, so I don't have to pile in the residential anymore. That's good. Do we get to... Maybe we can get to 1500 before this episode's over? Hopefully. My fears cost. That would be really nice if we could get to 1500. That would include doubling our population right now, but. I would appreciate it. How much until we get the high density stuff? 8,000. Holy crap. We have to do a lot of suburbs until we get to the high density stuff. Now it's going to be several episodes down the road. Maybe at episode 15? I don't know. Oh boy. Oh boy. Hmm. Everything's going down. Everything's going down. Which really disappoints me. There's nothing I can really do at this point. That's sad. That's very sad indeed. Okay, situate yourselves right next to the power lines. See if I care. Um, let's see how everything's going. Our industrial zone's starting to get a little aura of uh, radiation, I guess. I don't know. It's pollution, I think. Something like that. That's kind of funny. Um. Hmm. What? That actually grew that faster than I expected it to. I think I actually do need some more residential. Yeah, you want to make sure to balance everything when you're growing your city. Make sure it's not too much on one thing or the other. Why don't we have a demand for commercial? Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Building is leveled up. If you provide kids with education and have land items, buildings in your city will be approved. Higher level buildings, higher level buildings pay more taxes and house more people or offer more jobs. Pollution is reduced in high, higher level industry. Hmm. The more you know. Okay.
So we've balanced out our, what do you call it, residential area. And we're close to our next milestone. All aboard the high train, here it comes. Here it comes. Okay, it's going a lot slower than I thought. But it will probably come sooner than we think. You know, it'll probably pop up here and say, oh, guess what? <laughs> Called it. Worthy Village. No, we've got districts. Yes! Policies, take out loans, disposition service policies, fire department, police department, you build forestry and agriculture, which is exactly as we need for. We can get. Oh, yes. We can get This is gonna be nice. Power usage, water usage, detector distribution. We send fire station. What kind of unique buildings are we looking at here? Alright. Yay, fireworks! Okay, we're gonna let our city continue to grow, and while that happens, fire safety is at an all-time low. Okay, put you right there. Fire safety is gonna immediately jump. Voila! Police presence. Police presence in every single city. There we go. There we go. Everybody happy. Power. You're right across the street from something that gives you power. See, you've got power. Stop your whining. And the building is burning. Good time. Let's come over here. And back to our fire, since we will definitely not not healthcare. We need fire protection over here. Come on, people. Right in the middle of our industrial area. You're gonna get your power, don't you worry. It will come. There you are. I like how that like immediately doubles the area. That does like zero fire protection. But that's the best I can do. Police presence, you seem to be pretty good over here. I don't worry about it too much right now. Set policies. So what I'm going to do is moderately reduce energy consumption at times of stocks. That's way too much. I'm going to hold off on those, but I will make a district. A district. It's going to be right through here. Let's make it bigger. All right, Aspen District. Okay, I guess it's called Sterling Square now. Welcome to Sterling Square. Sterling Square is a nice community. I can box off the edges. Oh, this is going to be nice. I feel so political setting boundaries and stuff like that. Go. Go. That's gonna be nice. And we've got our demand for residential sky. Okay. So your policies. Let's see right here. You are going to be a forest. Everything's gonna disappear for a little bit. We're gonna make it clean. We're gonna make it clean. Sterling Square is becoming a forestry area. Let's see here. And our demand is still not for residential. So, that said, we are going to add some residential. I'm surprised that area has been built in it. Okay, we'll call that good for now. Everyone's probably losing their jobs. We finally get a demand for... Just a sliver of a demand, briefly. But a demand for commercial! Yay! Okay. We're not far to go, and we don't have very long for an episode. 
Let's pick up. Maybe we'll be able to make it. We got police and fire over here already. Covered by that one. Covered by that as well. Okay. Crime rate relatively low. Not in the 40s. Still demand, so we'll add another block air of residential. Oh, you definitely done that. This is gonna be all filled up here really soon. Oh, good. Everything started to balance out. Yay! I'm so happy. As you can tell. Let's take a look at our education. We'll need to get an education, people. I could put like an elementary school right here, but that's like a little piece, I think. I'm glad I have it centralized. 22% are graduated from elementary school. Okay, I can't wait till we get a high school and a university. Actually, educate our citizens. Everything's low, now. Everything's low now. What the heck happened? What the heck happened? Is it because everything over here is kind of changing? Here? I think that's what it is. Yeah, everything's starting to be yeah, built over here. Everything's starting to balance out. Oh, we're only a couple hundred people away from uh, getting what we need. So I don't know if people are going to continue to move in if I keep adding. Zones like this, but we will give it a shot. We'll leave that pinwheel area right there. About three grand negative in uh, growth. So let's see here. And then the only thing we really have any demand for is commercial. Seems like everything's relatively balanced out. Nobody really wants to grow. We got a way across town. Two halves of the bridge. Nice foresty area, which will eventually make this go down. And our demand for industrials coming back up. We got plenty of area for it to grow. You know what? I think I'm going to let this pause and sit for a little while. And uh, I'm going to leave this one here. Well, next time we'll get to our 1500 mark and we'll be able to really start growing. Uh, so, you know, leave a like and a favor on this episode if you enjoyed. Uh, comment on what you'd like to see me do and where you'd like to see me go from here. Um, subscribe if you want to see more of the show. And as always, I am Finian Poo, and I'll see you next time.